UFO sightings over Alaska, Japan, New Zealand and more. The moon, this image was taken by Apollo 17 during its last flight to the moon near the area known as Geophone Rock. It was catalogued by NASA as blank. After retouching the photo, you see that is not completely blank. If turning up the contrast, pyramidal structures can be observed. NASA has never given a credible version of the issue. The photograph actually exists and is the repository of images of the Apollo 17 mission at first glance seems to be veiled, but actually there are two structures, one with pyramidal and one in the bottom left that looks like a bar inclined. They are marked with orange arrows and yellow respectively. This new video confirms the existence of these two pyramid shapes. What can be the pyramids? Did the Egyptians also were on the moon? Are these two structures linked to ancient aliens? UFO Incident Alaska, this new UFO sighting is not the first one. Japan Airlines Flight 1628 was a UFO incident that occurred on November 17, 1986 involving a Japanese Boeing 747 cargo aircraft. The aircraft was en route from Paris to Narada International Airport, near Tokyo. On the Reykjavik to Anchorage section of the flight, at 1711 over eastern Alaska, the crew first witnessed two unidentified objects to their left. These abruptly rose from below and closed in to escort their aircraft. Each had two rectangular arrays of what appeared to be glowing nozzles or thrusters, though their bodies remained obscured by darkness. When closest, the aircraft's cabin was lit up and the captain could feel their heat on his face. These two crafts departed before a third, much larger disc-shaped object started trailing them, causing the pilots to request a change of course. Anchorage Air Traffic Control obliged and requested an oncoming United Airlines flight to confirm the unidentified traffic, but when it and a military craft sighted JAL 1628 at about 1751, no other craft could be distinguished. The sighting of 50 minutes ended in the vicinity of Denali, formerly Mount McKinley. Voyager, the interstellar mission, the twin Voyager 1 and 2 spacecraft are exploring where nothing from Earth has flown before. Continuing on their more than 39-year journey since their 1977 launches, they each are much farther away from Earth in the Sun than Pluto. In August 2012, Voyager 1 made the historic entry into interstellar space, the region between stars filled with material ejected by the death of nearby stars millions of years ago. Scientists hope to learn more about this region when Voyager 2, in the Helios sheath, the outermost layer of the heliosphere where the solar wind is slowed by the pressure of interstellar medium, also reaches interstellar space. Both spacecraft are still sending scientific information about their surroundings through the Deep Space Network or DSN. The primary mission was the exploration of Jupiter and Saturn. After making a string of discoveries there, such as active volcanoes on Jupiter's moon Io and intricacies of Saturn's rings, the mission was extended. Voyager 2 went on to explore Uranus and Neptune, and is still the only spacecraft to have visited those outer planets. The adventurer's current mission, the Voyager Interstellar Mission, VIM, will explore the outermost edge of the Sun's domain and beyond. Subscribe to Section 51. Thank you. Open your eyes, watch the sky with Section 51.